Hello, this is Dr. Johnson from physicsthisweek.com. I'd like to let you listen to an example of combination tones. Now, just as a warning, you may or may not be able to hear all of the pieces of this. My ear isn't quite well enough trained to hear uh, some of the tones, but uh, why don't you give it a try? So I've got one tone that is continuous. It's 440 hertz, and it's going to play the entire recording. Below that, I've got a second tone that is starting at 440 hertz and is gradually increasing up to 880 hertz. You will hear several different things going on in this recording. Initially, you should hear beats as the two tones gradually get out of tune. And then after a little while, you should start to hear a very low volume tone in the background that is very low in frequency that gradually builds in frequency over the entire recording. This is known as the difference tone, which has a frequency that is literally the difference between the two frequencies. And it is marked by the red dashed line. You may also be able to hear two tones that are gradually getting lower and lower in frequency. I will be honest, I could not hear either one of these tones as I was listening to the recording, but feel free to go back and listen several times. And if you have a well-trained ear, you might be able to hear those too. So I'm going to start the recording. Feel free to come back and re-listen to this at different volumes and see if you can hear the different combination tones that are occurring. So as I mentioned earlier, those extra combination tones might be hard to hear. So listen very carefully. They're very faint in the background. And feel free to go back and re-listen a couple of times. See if you can pick them out. 